I especially like the last few pages because that had a ferocity, it had a, a sweep to it that I felt was perfect. Uh, on other occasions, I'd like a little bit more colors and, strangely enough, more rubato. Mm -hmm. If you take the example that we listened to last night of Ignaz Friedman and study how he does the rubatos, how he does starting a phrase, going through it, that's the kind of thing that you want to work on. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's start it again. I had notes all over the place. Uh, I'll see how they work as, as you play. Now, this, uh, what, what, for the first, well, what is it, 23 bars or something? I don't know. It has this character of not really being there. And play more as in chords. In either can. All of that has to be like a chorale in a way, searching your way though. Play the background. Just, Just the background. From the beginning. From the beginning. So it's not a it's not a melody yet. You're just so, sorting your way, improvising on a mood that you don't you haven't completely expressed yet. The, the mood is a hopeful. Sorry. Peaceful. You're searching out the mood. You haven't established it yet. Improvisatory also. Yeah, not the da, 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 da. up to there was beautiful. What was the difference? I, I felt it wasn't as obvious as I played it. At exactly, the exactly. Very improvisatory and not really on the ground yet. No, make diminuendo. Make diminuendo. Beautiful. Yeah, also pedal. Just this slightly lift up for a second, but otherwise all of this in the pedal. Yes, that's it. Without, bring, without bringing... For me, it shouldn't be expressive yet. Yes. Don't take too much time. You, you've not begun the piece yet. This, you're finding your way, you're improvising. Even more, even more time. Yes, that's lovely. Unreal. Now is the beginning of the piece and the tragedy. Yeah. Now, it's important this idea of tempo rubato because you don't want to avoid. So, just play the, that without too much in the bass, just like just I sketched it. Yeah, just to the E. And then away. To the E and away. That's all it is. Beautiful. Take time, take time. When you repeat something, you either imbue it with more energy or you reflect on what you've played. I would reflect mm -hmm. on what I've played. Reflect now. You see, I noticed before I wrote someplace here, more rubato. You can't just say more rubato. You have to say a reason for it. So for instance, it's 
something like that. The same here. You push, and now you know where you're going. You have to go there. Time, take time. No, no, take time. Lovely. Beautiful. Okay, let's go now. That's beautiful. Why does it sort of leave its beauty. Do you hear it's, it's more by the notes, mm -hmm. the way you're playing it now? Take time, take time. No, take time, take time. And, right, it can take time there too. Now, I'm sorry to be such a pain, but uh, it's a difficult piece, and it's difficult to get how much rubato, how, uh, what different changes of sound. All of this to say I need more pedal. <laughs> All of this is fine, but I need If you say a statement, go go on. If you say a statement, that's your statement. Now you think about it. Yeah, take more, take more time. Right. Now it moves. Now think. Maybe not quite as much. Because of the passion. Yeah, I might be wrong. Because the passion is such that you can't immediately go down. Mm -hmm. I'm even wondering whether you, it should be less. It should maybe be more. Is I don't it, know. And then the F in the A flat. Yeah. That's not right either. You, you need some time. You need some rubato. No, take time, take time. You see, if you, this is one phrase. Now you think about it. So it takes a little time. Now, if you want to keep it at the same dynamic, which is possible. It can do that too. Try not to get too soft, once again. That was perfect. That whole phrase was beautiful. How does it feel? It feels better. I think I need to work out where, where, where exactly I do the rubato, because right. now it's kind of arbitrary. OK. Um, should we do the repeat? for a note change. You see, uh, there I would anticipate a little bit. Let's go back a little bit, because I th was thinking about the E flat, that you don't quite have the E flat right. This E flat has to have, because the longer line is, it's the same fourth. 
what you do quickly is over the long run. And that E flat is a very important note. Go down. Yeah, E flat again. E flat. Now it's going to D flat. No, don't. I need to hear that. Yes, and D flat. To the C, which is here. Yes. Does that help? Yes. Okay. This is more desperate. Aha, that's in another world. That's right. Yeah, I have, I think I told you this already about the introduction, that yes. this should be like the introduction. Something like that. Good. All in one pedal. Now painful. That's painful. Take time. Yes. Get the inspiration from the bass. It's a voice exchange. of the left hand that is too loud. That's too loud. Don't I should lead to the I think so. And then take maybe take the pedal off. down a little bit. No, that makes forzados on the... I know they don't okay. exist. Oh, there was something there. Uh, is there a pedal marking? I... I don't have a release of the pedal. What I just have a pedal marking that basically continues all the way through. What measure number are we? Uh, um, oh. 76. Oh, I have a release here. Ah, that's quite soon after. Quite soon after. Well, four bars, four bars after. Ah. 
I guess he's waiting for the chord to die down and then he takes it off, which mm. means that you have to make more of a decrescendo at that point. That's it. Lovely. Now all one, all one. Make little phrases on the E flat. Just little phrases so that it's not just one. E flat, E flat. It makes sense. The E flat is quite prominent in order to resolve to the D, D there. Mm -hmm. E flat. No, no, don't bring out all of them, just the E flat. Yeah, you go you go in many small phrases. I just want from the E flat down. This should move. This should move. I wrote it should be a bit strict. And again to the E flat. Now the D. Right. Okay, so now this is the middle section. It has to differ in sound and in feeling from the turbulent. Turbulent is the wrong word, but pathetic. So now. This is hopeful. Maybe a memory of, of, of a romance that was hopeful at the beginning. No. Uh, much more the top voice. It's not, I don't know, it doesn't have this uh, open, uh, innocent. All of that innocence. different quality of sound than everything that's been before it. It's not quite there. Maybe because you want it to be only one voice. You want to highlight only the soprano. Make it more like a chorale, so that every voice is important. That's too loud. No, uh, right. It's difficult. I don't mind if it's expressive there. It needs a sound. Uh, too much, too much. Yeah, that's it. That's beautiful. I don't mind the counterpoint. Just a little bit. Now more turbulence. Mm. 
More singing, more singing. Where is that? Yeah, that's it. Um. More. What happens if you don't make too much diminuendo? Um. very passionate. I feel it's very passionate at this point. As, as if you're saying, what happened to that wonderful rapport, what that romance that we had? This is gone. Th that's gone, and now it's led to pain. Yeah, move, move. Bring out the no, don't bring. Beautiful, beautifully played. Now, I have here my feeling when you played it before was it needs more colors, and when mm -hmm. I heard it just now, it needs to open up a little bit after you played this so beautifully. The pianissimo, the, the yes, yeah, that's it. Um. I wouldn't bring it out. All of this is a beautiful memory that's disappearing. You need just a little bit. That's good. Now no pedal. as uh, a distant Bach. Bach. No, no, it's too pretty. It's too pretty. Two, two entrances, right? Two entrances. Yeah. I want to hear the second one as well. Second. Third. go on again no this takes over this is 
at the top of the phrase. And it goes into one voice left. No, one voice coming up. But it has to come from that first voice. And now we're back to the piece. That's the last one. And that inspires the last variation. begins the fifth rotation. Is, is there a way that it could sound less impressionistic and more active and disturbing? The wind. That's it. Not so much pedal because other, this gets it gets lost. That's it. Yeah, I need this. And again, and more now. Okay, you'll work on those three uh, places that need to grow, one mm. more than the other, and so that you get a climax there. Okay. Okay, let's go on, because this is good. D flat. No, I really have to hear it. No, I'm sorry. See, if once you get almost as loud, it spoils you. Yes. The rest of it, nothing. Yes. feels too relaxed for me. I feel that this theme is very passionate at this point. He's lost her, basically. And there's one last attempt. It's not da, 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 da. I don't think. Yes, that's the right sound. Yeah, you can bring out. This is not sentimental a lot of feelings. Passionate. Don't go fast. Don't go fast. Very passionate. terrible is going to happen. It's a, really, it's a horrible thing, that. Um. No, no, not, not 
forgot to tee it all up. Too fast, dumb, bam. Stronger, yam, pam, pam, yam, pam, pam. Wait, now go. No, it's today. Today, no. <laughs> okay. What What is the feeling here? Tragic. Deep sadness. That theme has been transformed into something pathetic. Yes, but it's not romantic, it's bitter. It's not clear. One leading to another motion. Uh, sums it up. I don't hear. Yeah, much more. Once you put this forzado, then go away. I'm exaggerating. But. Yes, that's, so this goes. No. Right. That's much better. Much better, it's much clearer to understand. It. I would yum pa pa pa. That's it. Every note of that. 
Yeah, yeah, no, I missed it. Yes, that's it. Um, um, that's it. Okay. Well done.